Hey everybody and welcome back once again. Okay, so we are at the top of the origin tree and I'm about to um, carry on. I think uh, the ninth sister boss battle is about to happen. So yeah, you got that to look forward to. But before we uh, get into it, if you could leave a like, comment and subscribe, that would be amazing. For now though, let's get started. Hey, hey, it's my friend! Uh, whatever the creature is called, I can't quite remember. done hurting this world. I don't know what's got second sister thinking you're so important. She likes her souvenirs, but I'm not in it for the memories, and honestly, you're not worth my time. So let's make this quick. Come on then, you ugly bitch. Come back here! <laughs> Defense has run out of stamina, whatever you call it. Uh, he will. Okay. Look at that. So how far into the game I'm getting. I, I feel. I, you know, I am, and I'm still getting tutorial tips. You gonna hit me? Come on! <laughs> For a Jedi. Is there a difference? Come on, bitch. Oh, God. Oh. Bitch. Yeah, kicking ass. Although the four health canisters do help. Come on. Oh, oh, crap. Damn it. BD, Stim. No, no, no. 
Oh, come on. No. Oh, my God. BD, I need oh, that was close. I need a slip, BD. Oh, that was just bad timing on my part. You'll die like the rat you are. Oh I'm yeah, I'm dead. Here. Oh, I bet that hurts. Yep, there you go. I came close to them. Alright, let's try that again. Yeah, there's just a few like um badly timed attacks towards you know towards the end there. Overall though, I'd say that went pretty well. Like I did get pretty far in the first attempt. Yeah, I think with when, the, when you get to like the last part of that health bar you can't be too aggressive with your attacks like you can be in the beginning. Cause she just uses some of those uh un unblockable uh attacks a bit more often. Round two. We've got three left, that's pretty good going. What's the matter? Doubting yourself? You're not winning this! Oh, please! Who should I kill first? The Latero or the human? Bye bye, bitch. It's 
over. Being an Inquisitor taught me no setback is too great. When you've already lost yourself, a limb's easy. You know, I was a Jedi. It'd be fun to bring you in. Watch you crush like the rest of us! Oh, angers you. Just wait till the isolation, torture, mutilation, and your friends! I won't let you touch them! You can't stop the Empire! I can stop you. Oh yeah, she's coming back in the sequel. She's not dead. Just took down if you don't quicker. see her die on screen, then you know they're saving that character for other things. Hey. I thought you were dead. Glad you're okay. We should get back. Seer and Grease are expecting us. That was cool, though. I like, like, you know, the one good thing about this uh, game is the lightsaber duels do actually feel like lightsaber battles from a movie, because they 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 block your attacks. You can block theirs. You know, it's not a case of like Force Awakens where you just hack someone with a lightsaber for ages. And when you hit them with a the lightsaber, you see the marks on their body, like the wounds where the lightsaber hits them. See that? That's cool as well. Stuff like that. You know, little details. And the loading screen. My god. There we go. Uh, what was that? Did, what? Did you see that? Did I... Was I seeing things? Ooh, what's this? Gotta find them all! Collectibles! Wanna look inside? Okay, BD. What is it? The Guardian. Yeah. What uh, what ponchos do I have? Let me check. No, that's the one I'm going to be wearing because I quite like that one. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, fuck. No. Oh, I hate those things. Yeah, the spider's your problem. Bye. Huh, yeah, wonder if I can take him out. I hear you sneaking over there. Easy kill. <laughs> Gotta find them all collectibles. Just need to know, don't you? Oh, you found something. What are you doing here? Lucky block. <laughs> 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 Gotta find them all collectibles. They really do put a lot of stuff there in these go. maps. Okay, like you'll you? find a lot of, like a lot of the crates and boxes just by not looking for them. They'll just be in your path. Now there, 
that looks, uh, yeah, that's nice. I quite like the look of that. Don't mind me. Someone else take him. Right in the tree sap. Come on, come at me. Whoa. Ah, oh, what? What happened there? That was weird. Okay. They've got reinforcements. Go back to the prison. What? <laughs> what? Was that a glitch? That must have been a glitch. That's peculiar. I am tempted now to climb up there and see if that silver air is up there. Just need to know, don't you? Get abandoned. Oh, collectibles. Okay, let's take a look. Okay, the Wookiees aren't here. What about Saul? Is he here? No. And no. Okay, well, that was a weird. Oh. That was impressive. Eh. Nah. Eh. Nah. Let me try it once more. Oh, no, no, fair enough. Son of a bitch. No, oh, ah, uh, you gotta be kidding me, clown. Wait, what? Ah! Oop, that was close. Go there. No. He got what was coming to him. <laughs> yeah, I did not know that was up there until now. You come across something new all the time in this game. Now, where am I going? Down here. This Wookiee died from toxic fumes. The Empire is poisoning the planet. So this is the um, prison area we came across earlier. That's a brawler droid processing unit. You thinking what I'm thinking? Now, I could go fighting my way all the way back through uh, the Imperial Refinery, or I could just take a shortcut. I've got him! Something target! Something testing! Hey, BD! Get him! Hey, what the hell? Keep on 
Oh, this is annoying me. <coughs> oh, come on! Why can't I jump up there? What type of Jedi am I? Like, even double jumping only got me to sort of grip that ledge. I couldn't jump up there. Alright, that, I got my ass kicked there, fair and square. Um, uh, yeah, it's kind of annoying, those little bounty hunter battles, because they ran, they happen randomly throughout the game. After, a, after you sort of escape from the Axion brood, they just pop up wherever. Sometimes it's like a big droid, sometimes it's just two of them, sometimes maybe it's just like one of them. Um, when they all have different sort of abilities and so on. So yeah, it can, it can either be really fun, or very annoying. Yeah, let's customize the lightsaber. <coughs> oh god. Right. Yeah, I still got something wrong with my uh, throat for some reason. I haven't been able to get rid of it yet. Mm, okay, got that, got that. I quite like that one. Hopefully those guys won't be there again. I think there is like a trophy or something you can get if you defeat all the bounty hunters. <coughs> yep, gone. Here I go! Yeah, that's pretty much... Now that should be done. I should have taken this uh, in the last video, to be fair. I shouldn't have gone through the uh, <coughs> whole refinery. Because this takes you right up to the landing pad. And there we go. I don't think, if I remember correctly, we have to return here. That's like the, that's one of the things I have like problems with this game as well. It's like... Um, there's only a handful of planets, and they're all... I, mean, I, I think I mentioned this in the first part. But there's only like a handful of planets, and they're all sort of out-of-the-way planets, kind of. Which is kind of a shame. Like, you don't really get into like the any sort of... Other than Kashyyyk and maybe Dathomir, there's no like recognisable planets. Or like big planets, it's all kind of out-of-the-way areas. Which is fine, but all in all it just leads to their being very little happening, like in the world. Cordova believed the key to the vault is on Dathomir. You find your Wookiee? Yep. But things are bad down there. Empires everywhere. Inquisitors? Altrilla, the second sister, is gone for now, but she's still chasing us. I defeated the Ninth Sister. <laughs> Cal, when I was captured by the Empire, I resisted. I swore to myself that I would die before I would talk. But then this dark shadow came. And he was worse than any. Nightmare I could have imagined, and I still fought. But in the end, I came apart. And I gave them Trilla. 
And I know there's nothing I can do to make that right. But Cal, there's still a chance we can save the others on the holocron. Okay, look. The Ninth Sister said something about becoming an Inquisitor like... like it's inevitable. But you went through the same thing she did, and you didn't join them. Cal... It's okay, Seer. We'll find Cordova's holocron. Hey! Get your lasers off my lunch! BD-1, keep an eye on Cal for us. A little busy. I think I said I do like those little mob little cutscenes, little character interactions. It's just a shame there aren't more of them. Because overall, it's not. I wouldn't say it's a very long campaign, like a very sort of you know large one. Not like a say Knights of the Old Republic long. You know. <coughs> Let's see what's out there. It, it, yeah, I think a lot of the problems I have with this is it does very much feel like the first game in what could possibly be a longer series of games. Like, they're not jumping all in and doing something. They're sort of, like, just sort of shoving their toe in the water and just uh, checking to see if a game like this is sort of possible and if people enjoy it. So I assume it's... It's basically like first game in a franchise syndrome. Like Assassin's Creed wasn't the, the Assassin's Creed we grew to know. Watch Dogs wasn't anything like Watch Dogs 2, so I'm guessing the second one is going to be where this the game series really shines. And this one's just sort of like a proof of concept sort of game. Uh, which is probably the main reason, the only, the only real problem I have with it. Because it's like the third uh, Star Wars game EA has released, like the fourth one if you count the Old Republic. Must have had the but reason. it also feels very basic. Once we arrive. Red sunlight cannot be good for your skin. This place used to be home to a powerful cabal of Force wielders known as the Night Sisters. They use the Force? What, like Jedi? No. These witches served only themselves. Their powers focused on deception, illusion. Manipulation. <laughs> Sounds like someone I used to know. During the Clone Wars, the Night Sisters made a deal with a Sith Lord who betrayed their trust. In the end, they were nearly wiped out in a massacre. Dathomir is a deadly place. We should be careful. Don't have to tell me twice. Uh, ah, coming up on careful. our creepy destination. There you go. Grab some twice. seed, kid. Hey, Cal. You and her. Is everything all right? Hell no. That's not what's important right now. You know, Seer believes in you. And to tell you the truth, I didn't really think that much of you at first. I noticed. I mean, she got me to follow you to the scariest place in the galaxy, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, I hope you two can sort this thing out that's soon so we can finish this very quest good point. and go relax somewhere. I know a great castle on Taco Donna that makes the best bloody rancors in the galaxy. I get, I get the feeling though, since they introduced um, Maz Kanata, Cantana, Kanata, whatever, and Taco Donna in The Force Awakens, they feel the need to sort of push that in every single Star Wars thing they make. That's a movie or a video game. It's in Battlefront 2. It's sort of in Last Jedi. I think there's like a she's fighting in the Union or something. I don't know uh, <coughs> the Workers Union or whatever. Cal, like mentioned in this, it's probably mentioned in a bunch of comic books. You've come a long way since Braca, but the path is far from over. I want you to know the difficult challenges ahead. I can handle it. I know what you can do. I'm not denying that. And I know what has to be done. 
I've done it before. Cal, even the strongest of Jedi. I'm not Trilla. I'll be fine. I know you're not. I didn't say that. I'm not asking you to say anything. It's okay, Seer. Really. Just be safe, Cal. That's all. Hey, I know we haven't been on great terms, but can I talk to you about something? I need your help. I'm listening. I've reconnected with the Force, but I still feel blocked. Why do you think that is? Every time I open myself up, I see Master T'Pol. You felt this, yet you've continued deepening your connection to the Force. You know what that says to me? That I don't know what's good for me. That you're strong enough to embrace your emotions. Give yourself time. Seer, I... Thanks for helping me. It means a lot. Alright, so here we are on Dathomir. God, this place looks like a shithole, doesn't it? Look at it, just... Death. An ugly looking plant. And vines. Oh, whatever the stuff, like, there. whatever this shit is. What is that thing? Friendly. Oh yeah, and creatures that want to eat me. <coughs> Can't leave them out. Lesser Nidak. Okay, well, I am going to call it quits here. I hope you've all enjoyed the video and the commentary. If you could leave a like, comment, and hit that subscribe button, that would be perfect. Thank you. And check out the end screen for other stuff on my channel that you might like. Thank you all for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.